It is Kevin Miles. You watching Baller Alert. <laughs>So we're here at the George Foreman premiere, and you know, boxing is definitely the theme of the evening. So when you think about George Foreman, what are some things you think about when it comes to his legacy that you know? From the legacy that I know, like, I was just watching an interview about him, and he actually told me, not told me, as if I was there. You know, I felt like I was there. He was there. talking to you. He was talking to me through the phone, and my favorite part was when I found out when he gave his life to God. Okay. And he said it was a scary moment, but then that moment that he knew, like when he he literally got saved from God, when he thought he was about to lose his life. So that moment right there, like that was like special to me because being like a Christian woman, Christ woman, like that was a special moment for me. But his legacy is just unmatched. So. <laughs> yeah. yeah, for me, I uh, my father's love to show me all the boxing not just, you know, the, the fights, but also the interviews of the people, you know, Muhammad Ali lived in Chicago, I'm from Chicago. And so what I loved about George Foreman is the fact that for him, you know, it's a, a, a full turnaround. It feels like, feels like two George Foremans, you know, there's the one that's the dominant, you know, powerhouse in the ring. And then there's the one that we get today that went through all these trials and tribulations. And now he's just a, a great man, a great businessman. And I'm just happy to get his flowers, you know? So that's what I love about George is that, that full turnaround. He didn't like get knocked down and give up and just like fold over. He came back and he became a champion in life and a champion again. So yeah. I love that. Now, have you seen the film yet? No. no, no, no. What are some of your expectations? Like, what do you hope to see? What do you hope they touch on? What are you expecting? I have no expectations, honestly. I'm just excited just to watch it. What about you? I want to get really deep into right after, or what his life was like right after Muhammad Ali and then leading into him, you know, getting into grills and advertising. I mean, before his speech wasn't what it is today, you know, so he must have really worked on himself for a while to become who he is. So I'm just happy to see that. I love that. Mm -hmm. Now, Kevin, of course you know you from one of our favorite things that we see on television all the time. But what are some other things that you have coming up that we can expect you in? Well, I can't say exactly what it is, but I, I, I've got a movie coming out or that I'm filming uh, in the fall. So that's what I'll be doing. So expect me to see some movies. Okay, I can't wait to see it. Yeah, yeah, Thank yeah. you both so much for chatting with Baller Alert. Yeah.